Chicago Alderman says a downtown hotel is a crime magnet. Now he wants their license pulled after a shooting over the weekend. CBS 2's Tara Molina has investigated problems at the Eurostar's Magnificent Mile Hotel for months. Tara, this shooting violates an agreement between the hotel and the city. Erica, exactly. An agreement entered into because of disciplinary proceedings over a number of criminal violations at the hotel. Right now, just to stay here, you have to sign a document that says you don't have a gun and you're not going to throw a party. Someone fired shots in the room at the Eurostar's Magnificent Mile. A bullet came through the wall. Chicago police responded Sunday just before noon, finding a damaged wall and headboard. But thankfully, no injured guests. The men who called for help said they heard it all, but they didn't see who was behind it. And get this. He called the front desk and was put on hold. It follows months and months of issues CBS2 has tracked here. Criminal violations like smoking of cannabis on the premises, aggravated unlawful use of a weapon, armed robbery, unlawfully possessed narcotics, criminal sexual assault, and domestic battery. Those violations and other illegal activity led to disciplinary hearings we first told you about back in April, a $10,000 fine in September, and then there's this. These are the terms we've learned hotel operators had to agree to in order to stay open here, including requiring guests to register at the front desk and sign no party policy and no gun policy documents, an immediate notification of CPD of illegal activity and illegal weapons. Other stipulations? No more cash payments for room charges, no guest use of in-room balconies, and a requirement of licensed and bonded security on the property 24-7. So with the shooting here technically breaking that agreement, what's next? Alderman Brendan Riley's office told us he's reached the city's business and law offices calling for a revocation of Eurostar's licenses for violating this. But right now, those city offices will only tell us they're aware and violations will be reviewed by the mayor's license discipline commission. No response from Eurostars to our questions today. They actually never responded to our past reports on these issues either. And tonight, no one in custody in regards to that shooting over the weekend. Chicago police tell me they continue to investigate. Erica? Tara, is the state's hotel association saying anything about this? Erica, we have talked to them about issues within hotels in the past, so I reached out to them this morning. Nothing specific about Eurostars. However, they did tell me that overall issues and crimes in our hotels across the city are actually down. More information on that and more information from the city in this story on our website right now. All right. Tara Molina, thank you.